All right, let's take a look and see how to make a truth table. In this case, I want to make a truth table for the statement P or Q, and P implies R. So first I notice I have three variables, so I will write a column for each of them, P, Q, and R. Now I need to fill in these columns with trues and falses, and I want to do so in such a way that every possible combination appears at least once, in fact exactly once. For this I'm going to need eight rows, and the standard way to do this is to start with the column on the far left, and first fill in all the trues that you need. So I will have four of those, followed by four falses. Now I'll move one column to the right, to Q's column, and I'll alternate again trues and falses, but um, more frequently. So I'll do two trues, and then two falses, and then switch to two trues, and two falses. Finally, the last column will be alternating trues and falses on every single row. True, false, true, false, true, false, and true, false. Now I need to make columns for the various parts of my statement. And I'll build the statement up in parts. So first I will do P or Q. Notice I also have a part P implies R, so I'll do a column for that. P implies R. And then finally I'll have my entire statement. P or Q. and P implies R. It's this final column that I'm interested in, but my, pre my other two columns I'll use as a way of um, making sure I don't make any mistakes. Now to fill in the column for P or Q, I will just need to look at the truth and falsity in the columns for P and Q. So first, to find whether P or Q is true in the first case, that's when both P and Q are true. True or true is true. Again, the second case, true or true, same thing, true. Third case, true or false, that's true. True or false is true. False or true is true. False or true is true. Ah, but now finally, false or false resolves to false. False or false resolves to false. Okay, now moving on to the next column, I'm going to need to look at the columns for P and R for this one. So, true implies true, that's true. True implies false, that's false. True implies true again, true. True implies false, Again, true implies false is the only way an implication can be false, so that's false. In fact, all these last ones, the, the if part is false, and false implies anything is always true. False implies true is true. False implies false, still true. False implies true is true. False implies false is true. Now to find the final the, the fill in the final column here, I just need to look at the two columns I just generated need to look at the P or Q and the P implies R. So first I have true and true. That's true. Then true and false is false. True and true is true. True and false is false. True and true makes true, true and true makes true, false and true makes false, false and true makes false. So there you see the completed truth table, and from this I can read off any combination of truth and falsity for the sentence variables P, Q, and R, and say exactly what the entire sentence is. Alright, well thanks for watching, I hope this has helped.